Alright y'all, so we're here at the Atlantic Coast Kite Festival here in Virginia Beach. And they have so many different kites. They have birds, they got fish, dinosaurs, alligators, puppy dogs, a huge squid, crab, submarine. What do you think so far, London? Um, <laughs> it's crazy how they got all these to just like fly up here with like basically no one just like touching them at all. Right, so it looks like they're all hooked up with yeah. anchors and yeah. then it's just letting it catch yeah. the wind. Some of them are like hooked together. Mm -hmm. yeah. What do you think, Skylar? Um, I think it's just really interesting to see all the different creatures and the colors. Yeah, what's your favorite one so far? Uh, there's purple one that's got the slap us in the face. <laughs> it is pretty close, isn't it? The spiral ones that keep spinning, like Look, that black one right there. They have the same purple one up there too. They're like right beside each other, but that one's higher up. And that butterfly one, that rainbow butterfly one up there. Oh, I didn't even see that one. Yeah, I thought that one was Ricky, which one is your favorite one? Um, which no. kite do you like? Do you like the T-Rex or the crocodile or the dog? Um, All of them? Yep. Nope, okay. <laughs> which one do you like so far, Dad? I like the gray squid right here. Oh yeah. Is that a squid? I don't know. Like it's, a, it's some type of fish. Mantis. Let's see. Manta or whatever it is. Like a manta? So that one, that one right there. And then you said the T-Rex. I know the, oh, look. <laughs> We're getting, yeah, it touched you. We got the T-Rex right there. That's the T-Rex. The back side of the T-Rex. What's wrong? Look at that huge squid right there. Is that a gecko? I think that is a gecko. Oh, that's a turtle back there. Let's see what else is up here. We got fish. They got the American flag up there. That's the rainbow one that Skyla was telling us about right there. All right, let's see what else we can see. There's some more, there looks like some more down there, some airplanes and stuff. Let's try to go check those out. So we came down a little further and I think these are, so that's where we just were, where we just were, which are the actual kites that were put on by the festival. And then here are the personal kites that people just brought from home. Aren't they so cool? You can see them all down here in the sand. Just flying their kites, enjoying some time. And then they have another little demo field right here. And if you can see, they have trains. It's like some, what's that, an eyeball? Look at the airplanes. I really like these spinny ones.
This demo right here is called Summer Wind, and this contestant is from Ontario, Canada. Forecast is calling for rain and a bunch of clouds, overcast, no sun, but it turned out to be a very nice day. I actually have my jacket on and I'm kind of warm because I thought it was going to be chilly today. Yeah, go over, but it's not. Which one? Oh, are you talking about Nemo? Oh, I see Nemo. Oh, I see Nemo. Yep. Okay, I see Dory right there. She's kind of flailing. Oh, right there. That's Dory. And then that's Nemo. Oh, focus in on my finger. You know we love some Disney. We're gonna spot some Disney. Oh, it's a Minions kite.
So yes, that was the Atlantic Coast Kite Festival here in Virginia Beach, Virginia. The perfect after church activity. <laughs> it was free to the public. There was no cost. It was fun. It was fun. Got to play on the beach at the playground for a little bit. And it's not too hot. Nope, it's not. It's not too cold either. The clouds are actually covering up the sun. So it's not too bad. It's a really nice day. I ended up coming out of my jacket because it did get kind of warm just standing in the sun while we're in the playground, but it's not uncomfortable and not unbearable. All right, let's get across the street, ladies. But yeah, all in all, this is a nice after church activity. This cool Virginia Legends walkway as we're walking back to the car. White House Millennium Council, honor the past, imagine the future. Let's see. So this is pretty much all of the people who were born in Virginia and who were of great stature. Edgar Allan Poe, Bill Bojangles Robinson. This one over here is Captain John Smith, Woodrow Wilson, Yeah, I'm over here, guy. Had no clue Katie Keurig was from Virginia. I learned something new today. What did I say, Daddy? So dope.